Webflow family, I am going to show you how to apply a, an interaction to a drop down so that it opens smoothly. We're going to add some easing to the open. The default Webflow uh, action is that it just pops open. Um, let me see if I have an example of that real quick. I'm not sure. How it, yeah, so it just pops open like that. Oh, no, anyway, bad example. Anyway, I am going to show you what I've done. So I've applied two interactions, created two interactions. One of them goes on the button itself, the um, what they call the drop-down toggle, and the other one goes on the list, the drop-down list itself. So on the drop-down toggle, you just want, well, let's set the list first. So on the drop-down list, we're going to set it to um, the height to be zero. Um, let me show you first of all what we are going to make it look like. So what we're making it look like is it's going to open smoothly like that. Um, it does have a little bit of of, uh, of uh, hesitation there at the end because I have some padding on the inside of that list. Um, I'm going to adjust that later. But for right now, um, on that list, I made a an interaction called drop down list and we're just going to set the initial appearance to height of zero so that it just squishes that up to zero on the drop down toggle on the button we're going to add an interaction I called it drop down button creative I know and um, we're going to apply uh, you're going to affect the drop down list which I've called drop down in my styles and limit it to the sibling elements uh, so that it doesn't open all of them when you when you click this button, it doesn't open solutions also, that kind of thing. Um, and you're just going to set the, oh, I should mention, the trigger type should be drop down. If you do any others, it won't work properly. Um, and then just set the height to auto when it opens. Um, I did mine for a half second, 500 milliseconds. And on the drop down close, I did it back to height of zero, also at 500 milliseconds. You can make that a little faster to make it a little snappier if you want to. And that's it. Publish, and that's what you get. Enjoy.